Bob, uh, one way on 52nd Street is shut, and Greg will show you behind the Hearst truck. He'll move to the left here, and you'll see the police blocking one way, but the other way is open, and then 52nd Street is open one way as well. So traffic's getting around, as you can see. Um, but boy, this looks worse than it was. Nobody was a passenger in this Suzuki SUV because had somebody been in that passenger seat in the front or back, uh, they'd be in rough shape. Just look at the door sitting in the front here. And this restaurant, Big George's Stop and Dine, hasn't been open in years. So nobody got hurt going in and out the front door. And three kids on the bus, and we have some video of the helicopter first to get here, um, getting checked out but not seriously hurt going to Dobbins High School, which is about a five and a half mile bus ride from here. That's why they get bused from the Southwest Philly neighborhood they live in over to Dobbins. So uh, the bus driver doing okay as well. And I, uh, she's still here on scene uh, cooperating and telling police uh, what happened. And there's always a situation on 52nd Street. I don't think a week has gone by this summer where we haven't been on a serious story. We had that awful crash. We've had a couple of deadly hit and runs the last couple of weeks. And you see those city real-time crime cameras. And that one is right below where it says 52nd and Spruce. Those are run by the Philly Police Department. So they get video of events like this so they can see who ran the red light and who was driving safely. And even if you have the green light, you're going at a fairly decent speed sometimes. And buses don't stop as fast as cars and they weigh a whole lot more. And they got that precious cargo of kids. And uh, if you look on the bus where I am and Greg will come over here, you know, the kids do not have seat belts so they always go flying especially in a front end collision like this so that's why they always get checked out because they always hit their face sometimes on the seat in front of them and it looks like these seats are padded so hopefully all the kids are okay but a rough start to the school year and even the driver of this vehicle even though we couldn't get out of the driver's side uh, we're told by police that he'll be okay as well so it looks worse than it is but boy does it look bad here at 52nd and Spruce here in southwest philly a rough start to the school day and we see school police and school officials here on scene too making sure they get a full investigation and uh handle this as well for the moms and dads yeah. out there who probably already know about their kids and that their kids are going to be okay yeah it didn't look that bad from the air from skyfox i'm glad you got that ground camera mm -hmm. that man is nasty